<laughs> Hi guys, I'm over here, and as you can see, I put together a look slash costume slash. Well, it's definitely more of an inspired look because it's definitely not a costume because well, it's just a face paint and hair chalk, as you can see. My arms and neck are still. I was gonna do like, some costume. I will probably paint my neck or wear like some some longer sleeves. I know with my toy Bonnie look, I did like with my costume, I did um, a denim jacket. So I would probably do that with this as well. But maybe like a ripped up denim jacket, because then it would be like you know, all falling apart and stuff. And that's like the whole thing with the nightmare animal. They're not only way scarier than the um, other inner tribe, but they're also probably the part So that's like the perk of doing this kind of animatronic inspired look other um, rather than another one, like say the toy animatronics. The toy animatronics, you really gotta get everything like looking new and stuff. So it's a little bit tricky to get that looking good. Okay. If you want to see that, um, but yeah. So, with this costume, I am Nightmare Bonnie, and I guess we'll start with my hair. I put it up in two really high ponytails. I like put my head upside down and like tied them as high as I could, and then I smeared a whole bunch of blue hair chalk on it. Till I got the look that I wanted. You really want to go for like a grayish blue kind of color for um, Nightmare Bonnie. And that's really the color I tried to use from the top of my head to the bottom of my feet. And some are closer to a bluish gray than others, but um, I think I do it Um, And then um, you may have already seen, but I'm wearing like fake earrings that I made. I came across this video on YouTube of this girl, um, she, um, took, like, paper clips and she, like, bent them to be, like, little fake hoop earrings. I think fake because, obviously, I don't have my ears here. Even though everyone seems to think I do for some reason. Like, people give me earrings and I'm like, I don't have my ears here. And they're like, oh. And I was like... Have you ever seen anything in my ears? Yes, I. Yes, I. I never had my ears pierced, and everybody seems to think that I have my ears pierced. It's really weird. Anyway, so basically, these just fit onto your earlobe, so they're 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 like clip-ons, I guess, but they don't actually clip. Anyway. So I made a, I got um, like a bunch of colorful paper clips at the dollar store and I just uh, made this one day because I was just like, I want to create something I can wear, but I don't feel like making like actual like clothing right now. You know, if you ever get like, you want to make jewelry, but you don't want to make the same old jewelry that you've always made, like those paper beads or something. Anyway, back on to Anyway, um, so for the face, what I did was I mixed up, you know, the usual face paint that I use. Um, this time around, I used watercolors for the base with a Bath and, Bat Bat and Body Works um, lotion. Um, it didn't, it was a little tricky to get the opacity that I like, um, but it's okay that it's a little patchy in my opinion because. It not only does it give it more texture, but it looks like it's worn down, like maybe the animatronic fabric was worn down, so I, I'm thinking that's okay for this animatronic. Yeah. So, um, so after I did like the base blue, I did like a grayish black. It, it looks more black on camera, but I think it is black, but it's a really patchy black. But 
on the actual animatronic. It's a very, very dark gray. Um, so anyway, I did my nose and my whiskers. And if you look at pictures, you'll see that Nightmare um, Bonnie only has like two whiskers, but they're all janky. I didn't like mine very janky. Um, probably should have done that, but yeah. And if you are really skilled with like face paint or really skilled with um, makeup and stuff, you can go ahead and try to draw all the rows of teeth that the Nightmare animatronics have. But me personally, I didn't want to try to do all that right now. I just wanted to like use my regular mouth. But to represent an, an additional row of teeth, I don't know if you can tell on camera because my camera's really grainy and really laggy right now. Don't know why. Um, but I don't know if you can tell. Um, but I put on like a gl white glittery. This is the lip gloss that I put on my lips. Like white sparkly. It made me think of teeth. And I just lost a fake earring. Anyway. <laughs> so. Yeah. So that made me think of like the teeth. So I was like, oh, I can put this on my lips. And while I may not have like three rows of teeth, at least this will look and give the representation of those teeth. So like I said, there's a lot of inspiration from Nightmare Bonnie, but this is definitely not a costume per se. If you wanted to, there are details you could change to make it like a full-fledged costume. Like you could wear for Halloween, or I guess you could even wear at conventions and stuff. I don't know. Do they have like Five Nights at Freddy's um, stuff at conventions? I know they had some of it. I feel like they had some stuff at Comic Con. I've never been to Comic Con, but I feel like that's the sort of thing they would have there. Yeah. of this look. Um, yeah. So, that covers most of my body. But I wanted even more coverage because my goal with this was to try to like cover as much skin as possible because you know the animatronic, they don't have skin. Um, so I'm also wearing blue leggings and blue socks and these bluish gray shoes. Which, going back to that whole bluish gray thing that I was trying to do. Oh, I almost forgot about my nails. I also put um, a nail polish that I got from Five Below. I do not remember what the actual name is, but it comes in this purple and blue uh, bottle with a black lid, and it's like it's you know how everyone was about like thermal color changing stuff for a while there. This is like thermal color changing nail polish. And I just put like the thinnest coat on my nails just to make them like look like dirty and messed up. Like maybe they were like ancient and old and stuff, you know. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am feeling really tired now, so I'm going to end this here. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. This animatronic is, I don't know, what would you call going to the sleep for an animatronic. Oh. Oh, um. Powering, powering down? Yeah, I guess.
So I guess I'm gonna go power down now. Bye. Don't know what that was.